Hello, welcome to Zeus 5566. Today I'm going to make another Transformer review for Transformer 2010 Creator Primus. Some of you might already knew this is the repaint from Septon Primus and I believe many people had already owned this figure. But I haven't got it yet. So I grabbed this one instead. That it was much cheaper. So over here you could see this is Primus box and you could see this is a huge box. It doesn't fit entirely in my screen. Alright, so in front of the box you see a nice picture of Primus and on top here you see a logo says Welcome to Transformers 2010 and it was, it was almost 2011 now. Alright, on the side of the box you see here it says Primus is hidden inside the picture. So. Alright, and in the middle here you could see they already changed Primus name into Creator Primus. Not longer using Sabaton Primus. Alright, so, and on the corner here you could see this is the X10 pictures from the 2010 uh, Unicron. So, if you have both of the box, then you could. Uh, have the other one upside down and join them together then you will have a nice picture of uh, Primus join with Unicron <coughs> sorry I have a bit bit flu so it sounds a bit weird alright now on the side of the box you see a nice picture of a side view from Primus face and same goes to the other side and on top here you find another picture of Primus on the back of the box alright let's see this so over here you could see this is Primus in his robot mode a very nice robot mode and you could see he has a glowing red eyes alright and on the side here you could see some small pictures of uh, Primus in his various mode so this is the warship mode and this is the better planet mode now moving down you see <coughs> alright this is the important one moving down you see Primus in his planet mode uh, so you can see over here the planet mode is very nice it's in metallic silver colors and it was all nice and shiny Alright, now put this in your mind and in a while I'm going to show you the figure himself in planet mode. Alright, so under here is Primus script in Japanese which I couldn't read it for you because I don't understand Japanese. Alright, so now let's get on to what I'm about to show you. So you can see now, Primus in his planet mode, you're probably thinking what I'm thinking. This is not what we saw on the back of the box. Uh, I show this first because I want you to look at this when the picture just now is still fresh in your mind. You can see his color is very different from what we saw on the back of the box. Alright. <laughs> What we saw on the picture is something like a metallic silver but what we have here is a darker grey. I mean, don't get me wrong, I still think this colour suits him well but I would much prefer the metallic colour as shown on the pictures because that's what we get him for after all, right? Uh, I will still accept him in this color because I don't have a Primus yet. Also came with Primus is his Omega Lock. Uh, just like in the show uh, Galaxy Force and also his sub, uh, Planet Keys. Alright, this is a transparent Planet Keys which is very nice. And you could store this with the Omega Lock together by inserting onto the slots over here alright 
So the most you could insert is four different septron keys. Alright, so this omega log is very important. You require this, you will require this to activate some of the gimmicks on on Primus. So be sure not to lock, not to lose these two things. Alright. Alright. Uh, Primus in his planet mode. Uh, you can see all this nice detailing around the planet. Let me show you in up close. Alright, see all this nice detailing. <clears throat> Alright, and there are some Autobot cities on the on this planet and you could see over here. One, two, three, four. 5 and 6 and on the back 7 so but the only the top only the 4 on top here is painted gold the rest are left in suit in rubber gray rubber colors which is very dull uh, like this one over here all right and also if you see this if you could see this weapon coming out from the planet these are all left unpainted and it's in their grey color so it's very dull it's not nice at all alright so and also all these are very rubbery so be sure to be careful when you play with it not to break this alright and there are, one, there are one detail which I really like is the asteroids crashing sites on Cybertron. So if you could see here, this is the asteroids crushing site. Let me bring it up close to you. All right, you could see all the uh, focus, focus. Yeah, this is the marks that the asteroid crash, and this these are the asteroids. So very nice detailing on this, on this one, and it's also nice for them to provide four stands for us to display this to display Primus in his planet mode alright alright there are certain gimmicks uh, on Primus planet mode which can only be activated with the Omega lock and also the planet keys so the first one is the arms cannon uh, on his arms besides here so <coughs> you need to activate this with the planet keys just like the Cybertron one Right, what you need to do is insert the planet keys onto the slot besides him, beside the arm cannon, and it will pops out pops out the arm cannon. Alright, just like this, and same goes to the other side. Not very impressive but uh kind of fun kind of fun anyway. Alright, so and the other one the biggest of all is the dual cannon over here. Which you need to first, uh, let me show you, turn it backwards, alright? And you, you need to activate this with the Omega Lock, alright? First you need to insert, insert the, hold on, move this up a bit, alright? First you need to insert the Omega Lock on top of the planet onto the hole over here, alright? Put this on top and you will see the LED lights up and push it backwards and Yep, he will uh, flings out his dual cannons. All right, so yep, and if you lift the lift this part up, you will have uh, move, moving backwards. All right, you will have Premus in his better planet mode as seen behind the box. All right, so that's all for. Primus in his planet mode and let's get on to his robot mode.